So yesterday I posted a video about Tessa Blanchard getting released from Impact Wrestling and being stripped of the Impact Wrestling Championship. And the response that I got surprised me. Not, and it had nothing to do really with her release. When I posted the video on my Facebook page, uh, linked below, uh, when I posted the video on my Facebook page, uh, everyone commented on how putting the Impact Wrestling Championship on her was a mistake. And that surprised me. I thought, my opinion, is that putting the Impact Wrestling Championship on her was a... It was amazing. Um, it got more notoriety, more press, and more notice than anything Impact has done in the last few years. I don't know why people had the problem. I was shocked. Like, I was completely shocked. And... No one really explained why they thought putting the title on her was wrong. In hindsight, now putting the title on her might be wrong because she wouldn't give it up and they had the stripper of it. But at the time, storyline-wise, wrestler-wise, I don't understand why putting the title on her was a mistake. It, it can't be, be, is it because she's a woman? It can't be because she's a woman. Like, it's a, I, wrestling's been my life since I was yay big. Like, everything in this room is wrestling. I am a huge, huge wrestling fan. But make no mistake about it, and I've made videos on this in the past, wrestling is a predetermined sport. It's no different to me than watching a movie. You have to suspend that disbelief while you watch that television show, while you watch that movie. Otherwise, you're not going to be entertained by anything that you watch, because everything you watch on television is fake. Just weird. Anyway, um, so, and if it is because of believability, Sammy Callahan, like, nothing against Sammy Callahan, but he's a, I don't, he wouldn't be a believable world champion either. Like, if you're going for believability, Neither one, Tessa nor Sammy looks like Brock Lesnar. Like, uh, that's a believable world champion. So it can't be because of that, because that wouldn't make any sense to me. So I don't know what the issue was between having the title on Tessa Blanchard. Maybe you guys can explain it to me in the comments below. Let me know why you think, if you did, why you thought putting the title on Tessa Blanchard was a mistake. Don't Nothing to do with the fact that you won't drop it now. Let's leave that out of it, because everyone's comment was that they shouldn't have put it on her in the first place. And I want to know why, because I think it was a fantastic idea for the reasons that I stated. Storyline-wise, notability-wise, the most important thing you can do as a wrestling company is get people talking about your product. And that got people talking about the product. I hadn't watched an episode or anything on Impact Wrestling in a long, long time. And when I heard they were pushing Tessa Blanchard towards the World Championship, I was hooked. I wanted to see it. And then when she finally defeated Sammy Callahan in January, I think it was, um, it was fantastic. I popped. It was huge. Like, it was, it was one of those, a, a moment in wrestling that I'll never forget watching. Like, it was just such a big moment for, for the history of pro wrestling, for the history of impact wrestling. So, that's why I think it was a fantastic idea to put the championship on, on, uh, Tessa. Um, yesterday she got released. That's a whole other story. So, leave that out of it. Explain to me why you think putting the title on Tessa was a mistake or why you think, like I do, it was a great idea.